Bennett's Bailey, and today I'm going to be rehearsing a really, a really touching story that's near and dear to my heart. Once upon a time in a distant far off land, there was a stripper and a filthy used car salesman. Now, one day they were carousing through the desert just doing what strippers do, you know, looking for cocaine, marijuana, alcohol, and it just so happens that on that very same day, I was carousing the desert atop my alpaca, just, just how it worked. Now, I came across this stripper and filthy youth car salesman uh, during my gallivanting through the desert, and they they forced themselves upon me, especially that stripper. So it goes, you know, they had the stripper. She just had just cocaine hair and alcohol saliva, and you know, it hurts me to this day. It really does. Now, when I escaped the stripper and the filthy used car salesman, I, my alpaca was dead. You know, the, the, it snorted so much the stripper's cocaine that its brain just overloaded and it was gone. And I was alone in the desert, and I was just, I was trying to flee from the stripper and the filthy used car salesman as fast as I could, and I, I came across the Goblin Kingdom of the Sahara Desert. Even though I came from Nevada, it, it, I, I must have encountered some portal or something, because I, I don't know how, I was in the Sahara Desert. I saw black people, and I just, that's just where I was. So, when I was in the Goblin Kingdom, there was mountains of cocaine in the castle. There was mountains, as tall as Everest, in the middle of the Sahara Desert. And what what I had to do is I had to escape again. I found, I, I almost found myself escaping in these stories. But I escaped. And then I went home to my mom and she made me an apple pie. And we were rolling. That's just how it worked. And that's the end. So thank you for coming to my story time. And I appreciate if you stop it again. And maybe I can share one of my mama's apple pies. <laughs>